Well, if the muskies aren't behaving, go fish for something else. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy. I'm on another river float today. I've got my buddy Glenn up on the front of the little Alumacraft here, and we're gonna do a little bit of smallmouth fishing. Now, I know I mostly do musky fishing, but every now and again, it's nice to get out and actually catch something. Um, <laughs> and I've always uh, thought these little river floats are really cool, so uh, there is a chance at pike. I know last time I did this, I hooked into a catfish on a topwater, so it's just a, just a nice little river float. We're gonna be casting a lot of topwaters, so hopefully we'll have some action for you and real quick if you're watching and you're not subscribed do me a favor hit the subscribe button i appreciate it very much all right without further ado we are going to get to floating and fishing and hopefully catching some big trophy smallmouth bass all right i'm tossing a little buzz bait that i sort of pepped up here with a little bit of flash i took the skirt off of it and put some mag flash on there just a little tiny buzz bait. Another thing I did, so the band that you use to make the skirt here, threw that over the little R tie on here so that I can use, just in case you run into a pike, I have a steel leader on. So that's what I got. Got a little my old school Cronarch MG 50 on a six foot two medium St. Croix casting rod. So that's what I got rocking here. There's one. There's one. There's one. There we go. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. That was a good one. He's kicking my butt. I'm on the wrong side of the camera here. Ah, right ahead. I should be able to just grab it. There's a little red light on on the back. It should be recording. There now she is. All right. Might actually throw an anchor down here. Cleaned up pretty good. There we go. Dude, check that out. <laughs> Beautiful little river smallmouth, kind of where I thought he'd be, a little slack area. They're not footballs this time of year, but man, that is a, that's a long fish. I'll turn around real quick, Let's see what we got, put him at 10 inches there, oh, he's like, almost gets the 28, that's basically an 18 incher. Nice. Yeah, that's a good way to start out, dude. This yeah. sucker's like right in the back. You can't see. <laughs> that's all right. Sweet. There's one. There he come up and sucked her down. Yeah. Oh, that might be bigger than the first one, actually. Just gotta hit the button to get her started. Oh, that's a good one. Come on, buddy. Well, that's a, that's a dandy. <laughs> that's better than the first one, I think. <laughs> it's 
certainly wasn't going to get away. Yeah, man, that's that's what we're shooting for right there. Probably a nice, we'll give her a quick check here. Another nice, start at 10. Yeah, just about to 18, so about the same. Yeah, what a gorgeous fish. <laughs> All right, we'll get him back in the water here. Cool. Just had one take it down there. See, right out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Hit it again. There's one. There we go. Yeah, that's boy, that's a good one. I can't hardly move them right now. Grab that camera if you can. Yep. Any specific way you want me to film, like you, nope. fish? Whatever looks good. What do we got here? Another one of our smallie buddies, I think. Jeez. <laughs> I don't even think he's that big and he was kicking my butt. <laughs> He fought harder than both those other ones and he's not nearly as big. <laughs> Jeez, that is a scrappy one. He wasn't coming unpinned. Holy cow. There we go. There. Gosh, not nearly as big as the other two, but holy cow, that was a heck of a fight. It must have just gotten the current there. That was cool. Well, buzz bait. All right, Glenn, your turn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there it is. There it is. There it is. Oh boy, what do we got there? That might be a pike. Oh no, that's a bass. Holy cow, dude, that's a big one. That's a big one. <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> yeah. I should just get the net out. Oh, 
There we go. Uh, 18? Wow, that's 18, a. Maybe? It might, might be 19, yeah. Holy cow, he hit that like a ton of bricks. <laughs> Got ourselves another nice one. Probably another 18. Just stick them on the board here. 10. Yeah, it's like cookie cutter, just like the other ones. So, oh, we got a little spider in front of her. Get out of there, buddy. All right. Thanks for the tussle. There he goes. Wow, that thing was pinned hard, dude. I like, I don't. I've got pliers in here somewhere, but I, for the life of me, can't find them right now. So, all right. Now it's your turn. fish there and whoop, there's oh <laughs> it, it is <laughs> that's a tiny one <laughs> tiny little guy <laughs> yeah get get some casting over there oh no I, I see one right there there's still some fish over there. Oh, there's one. There's one there, dude. There's one there. See? I told you he was there. I told you. Shoot. Um... Fish is gonna eat. Get out and go after him. Okay. Get out and go on a trip? <laughs> yeah. Like walk in the real shallow stuff and then see how close you can get to that tree over there. Because that fish is gonna eat. I get get a little bit shallower and just kind of sneak along off to the right. Go go a little bit right. It's a little bit shallower up there. Sneak a little bit further up and a little bit closer and really get it tight to that. He's he's hiding in there. I just get it right, just to the right of that, all that stuff and just, man, if you can get it in there, it's going to eat that thing. There you go. There you go. Give it a couple pops, get it out in the, okay, now just let her float. All right. Oh, oh try it again, try it again. It's just wrapped. It's just wrapped. Oh, he, he ate it. It's that whole three second deal. All right, well, that went pretty good. We had, what did we get? Four or five, four or five fish, and three or four of them had to have been uh, that 17 and a half to 18 inches. So those are good quality smallmouth. Not the number of hits I was hoping for. I was really hoping to get Glenna fish, and uh, they just weren't cooperating. Got one good hit on a fish that we had located in a, a treetop, and we just couldn't get it to stick. Um, but yeah, this has been fun. Uh, I know I mostly do musky stuff, but every now and again, again, it is, it's really fun to come do this, these little river floats and just fish for fish that actually will hit a bait and not act stupid like muskies will. So, uh, thanks everyone for watching. Uh, if you haven't yet hit the subscribe button, I really do appreciate every single one of you watching and I will see you on the next video.